What's up guys, White Exotics here, and my chicken spider, Aranya Polito, has just molted in the last couple of days. So I wanted to get a good video of her. As you can see, she's there. She looks like she's growing quite a lot. And um, I'll show you in a second the, the molt log that I've got of her. I think it was two years, uh, it was the last time she molted. So yeah, her setup looks nice. I don't know what happened to the live plant there, it didn't last very long. But um, let's try and get her out a bit more. So this hide that she's got there is actually a log that I got outside and sterilised it all. And it's lasted really well considering the fact that I keep this enclosure quite damp. So as you can see by the um, chalky white mould looking substance there. I'll try and get her out, but I don't want to flick her hairs, it's the only issue. Um, but. I think she'll be. Oh, I think she'll be able to be persuaded out. Here she comes. Wow. Look at the size of her. So I reckon she has got to be close to eight and a half to nine inches now. So she's getting pretty big. I've heard they can get to ten, uh, rivaling the Goliath bird eater in size. Let me just try and move her out. She's starting to hiss. Here we go. Yeah, she's not very happy about being moved, but well, there you go. Let's oh, keep her that way. Yeah, she's definitely growing quite a lot, and her back still looks quite full. Yeah, nice big girl. It's been a while since I've actually seen this one. She, she has, I think she's gone off feed for about two months now, coming up to this mold. So, yeah, here we go. So here's my mold log. As you can see, I got her in, well, just around 2015. And she was six and a half to seven inches. I actually guessed her size. You can see there at eight inches, which is a pretty good guess because well, there you go. So if I flatten that out just a tiny bit, she will hit eight inches. It's a bit hard to do like this, but uh, probably end up breaking the mold. Well, anyway, you can see, look, just a tiny, tiny bit more sort of straightening the legs out, and she hits eight inches. So, yeah. Definitely looks like she's grown quite a bit. As you can tell by the carapace size. So, I'm going to show you. That was what her carapace was like before. And that's now. So you can see it right there, look at that. She's grown a lot. There you go. So just a quick video, guys, I wanted to get this on film as normal when, whenever one of my big teas molts. Um, I'll get a feeding video together soon. Obviously she's gonna be off feed for a little while, but yeah, amazing spiders. And uh, I believe they've started to come into the hobby a bit more, so you can pick up a sling for about 70. Obviously I've got her at sub-adult. Let's get her up there. She's not very happy about this, but I want to get the good shot. Yeah, so she's probably my top three teas in terms of size now. Got my H Gigas, got my Salmon Pink Bird Eater and her, and they're all quite similar sized. All right guys, hope you've enjoyed this video and I'll catch you in the next one. See you later guys.